for DMing me. You didn't see anything happen in the background. This is Zane. Bye. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I love you, Zane. You're Zane spitting facts. Nothing happens. <laughs> Epengu snagging the mic. Don't at him. Wearing the dopest shirt I've seen in, in days, yeah. at least. Yeah, like where did he come from that he was just wearing that? So stylish. Although, love it. Uh, Willie, Willie's wearing a sick shirt, too. All right, we're not here to talk about shirts. Look, no, all right, let, let's establish a few we things. We got the the now proven 499th best player, E Poodle, on screen. Oh, true, at least. With the forward smash. Because I am Mr. 500, of yeah, course. Yeah, I, I let the people know. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, it's a bit, it's a bit premature, man. <laughs> it's cooking. <laughs> now it's now it's official, I guess. Um, I mean, look, I, I watched this, and, like, okay, hacks, clear favorite, right? Yeah. E Poodle is just such, uh, devastating as a, uh, obviously really good against Sheik as well, but just it, it's it's hard to look at this as a Fox main and and have faith in your character. It's even if Hax wins, I, I don't know many Foxes that are looking at Hax like, oh, I can emulate him. That you should play like that. It's insane. No, he's got his own style, and people. I mean, some maybe newer. Uh, viewers might be like, oh yeah, it's because of the box. Like, no, no, he he was playing like this before. A lot of box playing comes from his style. People, right? People trying to emulate what he's able to do. Right. That's why he nerfed the box so that yeah. it, it, it wouldn't turn into. Um, well, let's not get he into that. He just wants to keep playing. He just wants to keep playing. You see, yeah. <laughs> this yeah. dude loves melee. He really does. I, I'm the amount he plays. He should hate it at this point. But something in him. But even now, he's like, look, I mean, the face, the, the, the lightning's not doing him any favors. He's, he's probably so happy right now. What, what a weird guy. You know <laughs> why he's happy? <laughs> because he's playing a game of Melee right now. Exactly. He's in tournament. He's up against E Poodle. He's down a stock, but he knows that that doesn't mean much. He can actually make this back. I that's, think a counter there. That's uh. A any boxers in the chat, I'm not going to read it, but I'm curious, how the hell do you get angles? So You modify it, right? You, you have you the click and clack? Yeah, you have your tilt modifier, so because of that, you're limited in your angles. You have a couple, like, crazy angles from, like, you, there's one that, you know, you can get a cheeky downward, like, I don't even know what the like angle the, is. the barely not straight, because yeah. there's, like, a dead zone. Yeah. Right. I'm using my hands right now. The stream no, can't good. say that, but, no, like, a, like, a 15-degree... Uh, angle kind of thing. We're talking out our ass, aren't we? Yeah, something like that. <laughs> the 15 degrees. The 472 <laughs> degree. No, but you are limited. You have a couple <laughs> like really good angles, but I feel like if you're very experienced against Box Fox specifically, you know those angles. Mm. And against, I, I, from my experience playing against Box Fox is at a lower uh, level. A lot of times I see them just not use those modifiers. They just sort of like go straight at you. Or like 45 degrees. Yeah, or, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, you know, kind of, they do a few dumb angles and people would argue that the the recoveries are nerfed a little bit. Wow. That's fair. And he's, this is, yo, he's bringing this back. He was down a full stock and now it's, it's dead even. Making really good use of the top platform. Knowing Some, Marth has to commit to get up there. Sure. I'm going to do the, uh, the the trope of talking about myself. Hex did give me advice in this matchup. He said, use bear. Yeah. That was, he's, he says, back air is like way underrated. Oh, but you're playing sheet. Look at Hex gave you advice and you're. That's what I'm saying. I'm like, shut up. Tell me in six months. <laughs> All right, that was probably missing, but uh, use bear and um, uh, shine gim and drill drill grab. Yeah. And look at this. Up throw bear. He says, every, every uh, up air will be a gamble. They can SDI and hit you with the Kalindi tweet. Bro, he's just not gotten touch. He just dash attack and that's crazy. And the up air. He's gonna close game one. Head to head 7-0 hacks, no shot. That's a that's a mental barrier. Yeah, that's gotta I mean, be. As we know, Fox Fox Marth has 100 0 according to the data right there. 100 0 I, Fox. Sworn e Poodle had a hack when am I smoking ass? What happened? I mean you're the one that puts it on there. I don't <laughs> I, I, that is incorrect. Okay. For uh, anyone that doesn't know all those head to heads is just Brando's memory. He just, <laughs> <laughs> he just It just is going off intuition. He's like, oh yeah, E Poodle for his hacks, 7 0. Wait, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Well, uh, I guess I'm just a silly Billy, and yeah. then whenever the VOD gets uploaded for this week, I'm just going to be wrong in one of the earlier sets. 
it's all good. Uh, I think it was uh, was it Big Buffalo versus E Poodle? Yeah, B Big Buffalo has the win. <laughs> yeah, not I, E Poodle. I know E Poodle has wins over Aklo. I that, that's I've personally what I was not seen of. the hacks. That's what yeah. that's what I was thinking of. My bad. You know, because he had the Aklo win where uh, he had to beat the Link on FD, got through it. Link, Link Low, Link Low. I love Link Low. Oh my God! And you know, if you're coming to uh, the function three, I saw Aklo and Kadoran both entered. It is at Brookland. They might get a little bit of a redemption rumble redemption. Yo, you want to hear a little inside, a little inside info? Yeah, please do. So I'm, I'm probably the lowest effort. To oh my! I don't want, I don't want to interrupt any combos here. Yeah, please do. Well, I, it's always a pet peeve where a sitcom is happening and someone talks about how at Function 3, there's going to be a after party. Oh, okay. Uh, right around the corner. I mean, this this is a local bar tournament. I think that is, uh, you're allowed to, to drop that. Well, I'm the guy Over the combo. I, I, to, to brag, I'm the guy who sent the email out okay. asking if there's space. And they said, are you Poonslayer? And I'm like, how did you know? And I'm like, they're like, Jesse Gardner 7 at Gmail. There's only one guy that first last name and that number. Um, and then our, I signed our DMs some, open? And then I, he signed titties. My DMs are open. OK. You ever, you ever e sign a pair of tits? Are we going to get banned for that? I don't know even care. know what you mean by that. Anyway, uh, Aklo uh, e-signing this game with a shine. That's why we work, man. That's that's <laughs> why we work. Ew. And a nice ledge grab. This is why he's 7-0. That's, that's cannon now. It's head cannon. Double. Uh, I think that was an important double uh, spot dodge. Ooh, the triple. Hit him with the Ken. Who? Uh, Sephiroth Ken. Oh, Survivor Season 14. Oh, yeah, Finals yeah. You know. Ken. You know. Yeah. That. Survivor next week, by the way. I don't know if I'll make it <laughs> to the next nightclub. Are you on? Are you on? Dude, I'm going to apply for sure. I'd root for you. We need, we need more so. melee player. We need more melee player overlap with Survivor. Ken was really good that season. He does not get enough credit for how he played. Uh, that season was kind of a shit show. There was not a lot of strategy, a lot of uh, emotional gameplay in that mm. season of Survivor. But Ken locked it down, and he kept his head in the game. But then, you know, he played the meta with a bunch of people who were so outside the meta. They're right. like, I don't like that you were, you know, lying. And they fucking, they got him. Yeah. No, I, I remember the interviews, and he was talking, like, honestly, it could have been, like, the interview for an MLG 2005. <laughs> Wait, he's like, he's like oh, yeah, I was, I, was like, I was coming in on him, but I'm playing mind games. I was bringing the mind games <laughs> to him, and they just, they weren't ready for it. <laughs> I didn't wait, that's, they, that's they weren't ready for the second level mix-up, and I'm like, this is hilarious. Are you talking about Isaiah, or, like, you're going for the idol here? Like, yeah. I don't. <laughs> when you use interview one for, for competitive game two. Yeah. <laughs> that's insane. He was, he was in their head. That's so wild. He really was, though. He was good at that shit. Oh my god. We need we need Ludwig to be Jeff Probst in a melee survivor. Whoa, that side B was a little weird. I'm sure Ludwig is already cooking up a, a survivor. I'm sure he That's watches good. Nightclub every single week. For ideas. Yeah. Yeah. Big fan of our local scene. He actually does support the melee scene. Oh, dude. He's given back 30-fold. Shout and out to all of our, our melee billionaires. Uh, or millionaires. <laughs> uh, H billionaires? Fox, Not yet. Mango. Ludwig. Shout out to All Jigglypuffs. And uh, Dylan. Dylan um, all Jigglypuffs. If you want to make a million dollars. All Jigglypuffs. That's funny. Play Jigglypuff. That's fine, because they could spend their, all the time that they're in the air, they could be trading stocks. Yeah, all that time that you don't spend businesses. practicing the game. <laughs> 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 they put in their 30 minutes a week, and then they, uh, yeah, If you, you don't know. have to pay for physical therapy on the hands, like, oh, all that, that capital is just opened up. It's messed up, because they have insurance, nice and they don't need it. And shout-outs to all of you that are watching right now. All, yeah. all of you who tune in every single Wednesday, um, we, have, we have a couple of, like, you know, High level, uh, you know, influencers and and players and whatnot that you, that watch and tune in every week, and we appreciate you. Thank you, Cody, for uh, giving us a raid pretty much every week. Amsa used to give us a raid every week. Ginger, Amsa used to. It's a crazy call out. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you know, <laughs> when he's streaming at the right times. Yeah, you shout know, it's, my, it's, yeah. Just, shout it's just, just got to it's just got to line up. Shout, shout out, out to, to all the locals that are out there doing it. Shout out to very local melee. The the uh, 
group that does Verdugo and uh, what's the other SoCal local? Uh, it's pissing me off that I not, I'm not. i losing it right now. It's Wait, like I, have, I, have a, I have an important shout out. Shout out to Brando, always keeping it. Let's go, Brando. Keeping Wallace. it a perfect stream, yeah. consistent, showing up, doing the dirty work, and always keeping a good attitude. I don't think that that's uh, people sing your praises of being both competent and just like, such a good dude. Shout outs to you, Brando. Yo, give some hearts, give some ones, give some oh, a 3 0 uh, hacks uh, against yeah. Yeah. He's, <laughs> he's not happy about it at all. But yeah. shout outs to Brando I, for I being the goat. I try and hang in there. I try and hang in there. He's keeping us together. No, you're the Keeps best. things lighthearted. Oh, shout outs to this lighting. Also, if you come in person, you get to hear him call out each match. We got like. To the stage!